Uh, my name is Paul Manning. I represent PMC Binoculars. We restore World War II binoculars. Um, I first got involved in refurbishing uh, large binoculars as a hobby. Um, and then what happened is some friends came, they liked them and they said, we'd love you to do a pair for us. Um, and it grew from there. The first pair that I got actually came from a soldier who brought them back from World War II. Um, and it's been like that ever since. I have people that come and approach me at the shows. I also buy from governments that uh, captured them during World War II and they have them in storage and I buy them from them and then I refurbish them. So this pair of binoculars here is typically how we uh, receive the binoculars. They're in very poor condition. Uh, they may have uh, broken internal mechanisms. Uh, they also can be missing lenses and prisms. The prisms and lenses are so expensive that you cannot even uh, hope to have them manufactured today. So we wait until we have uh, the various parts that are needed for them and maybe out of two or even three binoculars we'll build one. Um, so this is typically how we receive them. They're covered in paint. Um, heavy lead paint, so we remove that paint through a sandblasting process. They're all hand sanded and then we polish them until they look like the binoculars that you see behind me here. So this one that you've just seen, this is what it looks like when it's restored. This binocular is a particularly unique binocular. Um, it was made by Zeiss during World War II for a battleship. Um, there were only about a hundred of these made. Many of them were destroyed in the factory. They were actually destined for Germany's second fleet, which was sunk. Um, uh, and when Zeiss produced these, they were really the pinnacle um, of, uh, of uh, lens production. So this is a, a very unique binocular, has incredible optical vision. You can uh, focus it up to around five miles and you can get as close as maybe about a hundred feet away, everything being in focus. So when you look through it, it looks as if everything is like 3D. Uh, we don't actually manufacture binoculars like this today. Um, even for the military. The directors of Zeiss have had a look at this uh, and they've said that it would cost over $100,000 to produce a binocular of this quality today. The prices of the binoculars uh, start at around $6,000. They go up to even as much as $40,000 for, for particularly rare pieces. This piece here is $25,000. We have the original case for it and we have the uh, visor that fits on here as well, the headrest, uh, which an operator could use to cut out more light as he looked through it. I've exhibited at a number of shows around the country, but now I only exhibit at the original Miami Beach Antique Show. I find that it's an incredible opportunity for me. My customers are able to see the new things that we have and many collectors come and buy from us here at the show and contact us throughout the year.